Hi, um, I am, sorry, trying to make a video of working in my craft room. Um, well, it's like my craft room slash the cats hang out in here slash um, my kids will be sleeping in here. Um, but anyway, so I have some stuff to do. I just spray painted some shelving um, red because I like red. Um, see, pretty, wait, where is it? Oh, my wheelchair's blocking it. Sorry, hold on, hold on, let me move. Okay, ooh, see, pretty, red. <laughs> so, anyway, I um, just painted them, and in the process, of course, painted my hands, you know, because I can't do anything, like, without getting messy. Where's the fun in that? So anyway, now I'm going to work on a couple things. Like one, when I spray painted those um, things. Okay, I have on my wheelchair. Scoot back. Ooh, you can actually see all of me. Um, on my wheelchair. On my footrest. Here it goes. It's coming. My wheelchair is dying. It's so old. It's over five years old. And I'm supposed to be getting the new ones soon, but I haven't yet. Okay, so I have these little slipper things, um, which are actually shoes that I got at Walgreens. Like, they're kind of like Crocs, but not totally. Um, but anyway, so um, let me back up and show you this part too. Okay, so um, can you see it? No. Well, anyway, I velcro them onto my, the footrest on my wheelchair. Oh, you can kind of see. Okay, so this one. Anyway, so it's velcroed on there. And then they're my toe guardians. But when I was spray painting those shelves, the beautiful red, um, then I got... Do, do, do. I don't know if you can tell, but... There's pink stuff on his eyes. Um, so, I'm going to take them off. Because that's what I do. I just do them on with Velcro. But I think I'm actually going to throw these ones away. Because I got new eyes. I got just a packet of them at Walmart the other day. Um, just little wiggly eyes. Got a packet of 12 packs. So, what I'm going to do is cut some Velcro into little circle shapes. And then um, I'm going to Velcro some new eyes onto these little slipper things that I picked up. So what I do with these, I hook them, I Velcro them on like by strapping it around the footrest. Um, and then I, oh, hold on, I gotta find the right stuff. All right, there's that side. Now I need the grippy side. That's the weird thing about MS. Both of these feel the same. There's, um, well, like, n now that I've been messing with it for a little bit, this feels a little bit pokier, but, um, a lot of times I can't tell which side of the Velcro is which by feeling it because my hands are numb. Um, so, anyway, that's just one of the weird things that having numb hands does. Um, but, thankfully, I can see it, and MS can affect your eyesight, but thankfully, it has never affected mine. Um, however, you never know what it's going to do. It's one of those tricky diseases that um, can't seem to make up its mind. <laughs> so, anyway, we'll see. It started with my... Um, with my legs going numb from the, I went numb from the waist down. My butt actually went numb um, first, and then it was like the right butt cheek went numb, and then the left butt cheek, and then it started spreading down my neck on my legs. Um, and when the kids would come running up to me, um, and forgive me if I've already said all this stuff before, I don't remember. Um, so anyway, so the kids, I worked at daycare, and the kids would come running up and hug me, and um, 
their hands would always feel wet. I would always think their hands were wet. But turns out, you know, eventually I got where, like the numbness got so bad and I was weak um, in my lower extremities. And um, so they, anyway, I had to sit down and scoot with a laundry basket because I was so scared of falling. So at that point, my boyfriend talked me into going to the doctor. I think that was pretty, that was when I was ready. My boyfriend, at the time, he became my husband. He became my ex-husband. Um, but anyway, he is the father of my kids. Um, okay, so the thing with these shoes too, the they the type of material they are is like Crocs, you know. So. Um, the Velcro sticks really well to it. It sticks better. I had, I made some little things like this um, with slippers, um, and they were cute and stuff. But the Velcro doesn't really stick very well to it. But these ones will. Now, okay, so I want the the rougher side of the Velcro to be on the actual eyes. Um, so that if I ever take the eyes off to wash this shoe or whatever, then um, it's not snagging on that as bad. Okay, so let's see, I'm trying to get the thing. Anyway, um, okay, so I was talking about my MS. Anyway, my, yeah, so I have MS. So now it just affects all kinds of stuff, but um, I like to do crafts. And so that's something that I can do to keep my mind busy. But as my whole movement states, my biggest thing is getting out. I think it's really easy for disabled people to stay home a lot. There's not really a reason. There's no incentive to go out, which is why advertisers need to start paying us to advertise. But um, anyway, hopefully one day someone will s rent my ad space, um, Pub Juice, I think it was. They are the first ones who actually did rent my ad space. Um, so I'm going to frame the money I got from that because it was my first, like, job that I've had in a while. Last time I worked was in, I don't know, like 2003. I think I quit the early 2000s or to have my son, um, which was a good reason for putting it on. Alright, so now that eye's on there. Uh, maybe I put it too far over. Well, I can move it if I want to. Guess maybe I'll do that. I'm not picky at all, but then occasionally I get in like a picky mood and I just get picky. <laughs> so, sorry, it's about the eye placement. Alright, um, now what? Okay, now another eye. Another eye! This is a long video. I don't know, but people do this stuff. Like, my daughter was telling me that some of I don't know, Cookie Swore is these videos are long, but I know I'm not as cool as she is. But still, I can make a long video too, right? So one guy at the writers' conference, he was amazed that I'm not already making money with my website, which I'm not. Um, but I think it's because I don't have any ads on it. Um, but I don't know. I kind of like don't really want to sell my ad space. I'm kind of sad about it because I do need to make money. But I like having my website ad free. I mean, 
If somebody would just pay me to advertise, look, see, this is where my ad space is. Every single wheelchair and a lot of medical equipment, like walkers and stuff, have plenty of ad space. I use it. This says happiness um, looks good on you. Um, and this one says, no, no, make your own sunshine. I don't know if I destroyed my paint thing. Anyway, so one of these days, advertisers, like, or companies, companies in general, companies that want to support the rights of disabled people to have jobs, um, and companies that want to encourage disabled people to get out of their home, and companies that want to um, have the good PR for supporting the rights of disabled people to work and the um, for being the leaders in that because one day wheelchairs and medical durable medical equipment will be used as advertising I'm sure but um, the first people to jump on it hey here's your chance um, You want to first. Okay, so now that is my shoe. So what I do, I put the footrest, like the whole shoe goes underneath the footrest. So my hand right now is pretending to be the footrest. So hand, and then um, it, 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 you know, I cut on the sides right here so that it um, can, I don't know, kind of like flip on there, you know. So that goes on the front of the footrest. And then, um, so then my foot can go in there. And this one is my foot. Then um, my foot would go in there. See, that's cute. And it works. And I have a pair of white ones. And since they're Velcro eyes, I can just swap out my eyes just in case I lose. Because um, I lose a lot of stuff. But anyway, okay, so there's that. Now I'm going to put it back on my foot rest. Because um, these are, are literally the guardians of my toes. And they literally guard my toes. My toes um, have, okay, I have, my my toes are just a tiny little bit longer than the footrest, and so um, I, sorry, I'm trying to get it under that velcro. Alright, so the heel on the shoe is actually, it's, it's a little bit wider, so I try to put the velcro um, right in the kind of, um, what's that called, the, like the arch of the foot, and then that way it holds it on there pretty good, but this one fell off earlier, so I need to see what is going on with it, and I'll show you that. Do you see the difference in the toes? Oh, I shouldn't have put that one. Oh, well, I'll see if one of them. I'm going to see. Yeah, so this one came up earlier. Sometimes they fall off. That, that's the, the bad part. But I want them to be removable because. Um, okay, now this one I need to be, you can see it better. Right? Can you see the pink? Yeah, it's all pink from the spray paint that I use. Okay, so now I'm making some new ones. Making some new ones. Making some new ones. Oh, yeah. This is on. This way we go with them. Um, like that. The cat's like this in wheelchair because they can just jump on it like that. Ah! Hold on. I'm trying to fix this thing. Come on. Come on. No. Orange. Mm -hmm. He's a big fat cat. This looks nice. 
I think it's pretty. I think it's really pretty for for a lot of girls, especially if you've got like a dream of doing that, that princess thing and you're going to prom or um, you've got some other reason to dress up, then yeah, go for it. Um, but for me in my particular situation, um, I'm kind of in the position of being forced to become asexual um, because um, people in wheelchairs, it's just expected that um, either we don't have sex or we can't have sex or, I mean, a lot, I think, I know I'm not the only person in a wheelchair who um, is in this position of just not being seen as a sexual being at all um, because of the chair. So, anyway, that is an interesting experience. Of course, there are some people who who see it as attractive or who see beyond it. Um, but it's, I don't know, it can be a challenge sometimes. Sometimes it, you get to meet some really interesting people. Um, so I guess that's fine. I have to concentrate. When I concentrate, I can't think or talk or anything. I just have to concentrate. Right. Um, one more Velcro square eye circle. Okay. So, anyway, that's me. I'm making eyes. I don't know. So what are you supposed to make long videos about? Like, what's the point? I don't know. Do you all want to see me talking and just making crafts and stuff? Or is this a stupid video? I don't know. Alright, I'm going to stop it. If you want to see other videos of me doing all my little crafty stuff or stuff with my wheelchair or um, whatever else I'm going to end up doing, then, um, I don't know. Tell me. Thanks. Bye.